Mr. Scammell, Coach Brandon here, inside pitch. Hey, just running through a few swings here. You know, things look pretty good. Uh, a little off the end of the bat on that one. <clears throat> Same thing, a little bit off the off the bat on that one. Notice that contact here where your front foot is. A couple things that I'm noticing here. Um, you just got to do a better job uh, keeping this foot grounded, especially at contact. Um, this this right here is leading to forward and upwards head movement. Okay, and a lot of a lot of your body just drifting into the ball. And when that happens, we lose control of the bat. <clears throat> your ability to stay grounded right here with the elbow back and the hands in a good, you're in a great one position, probably the best I see so far on the team of any ones that I've done. Uh, it, from this position, though, you've got to identify, do you need to wait on this pitch? Does it need, do you need to uh, get going on it? And, and so basically it comes down to your ability to identify where the pitch is and then, and then when you need to trigger the back knee, the hips, and then the hands and the shoulders. Okay. Otherwise, I mean, mechanically, you know, you you look pretty good here at foot strike. Again, we really shouldn't have very much head movement, you know, outside of this. And you really come a good two or three inches forward, and you're moving up as well. That's really going to cause you to lose barrel control at impact. And you know, obviously, what happens at impact is the most important. So, planting this, firming this up, hitting into a stronger front side, and not letting things move a little bit. We just need to think about rotating around a stable head. You're gonna you're gonna be a lot more consistent. So, uh, keep an eye on that.